Good morning, Shackley family. Welcome to Nashville. So we're here together in Nashville, one of the cities in America that has one of the most amazing heritage, but it's also one of the fastest growing cities in this country today. And music has always been the heart and soul of this city. Now, as you know, or many of you know, music is one of my passions. And I've always been fascinated how the simple act of putting together a few notes can create a melody that can move millions of people around the world. And I want you to come with me for one second and just place yourself back into time in the year 1804. And Ludwig van Beethoven was sitting at a piano trying to compose his next heroic symphony. So he was sitting there. Except I don't think they invented the blues yet. But he's trying to find something. And with just four notes, three of which are the same, he created one of the most lasting and memorable pieces of music ever written. Listen to this. because whether it's creating a symphony or anything else in life, it's often the simplest things that can create the biggest effect. So let me share because it's true with us as well. Just take the act, the simple act, of cleaning your bathroom mirror. Now for most people, that act is an act of drudgery, of work. But when you use Shackley, Suddenly, that act of drudgery gets transformed into an act of great significance. Because it turns out that the chemicals in ordinary cleaning products have been shown to trigger asthma and allergies. And I've come to learn that from personal experience when my son Spencer, at the age of four, had to be hospitalized after having an acute asthma attack. And ever since we switched to Shackley cleaning products, it's been 3,347 days since he was released from that hospital. And we are grateful for every single one of those 3,347 days. Now, in addition to protecting your health, Shackley also saves you money because we pioneered the idea of super concentration. So that one bottle of basic H squared is the equivalent of 5,824 bottles of the leading glass cleaner. And at an average price of $1.98 for their products, you would have to spend $11,531 with them as opposed to $10.35 for Shackley. <laughs> and it gets even better because we're also helping protect the planet at the same time because if just the people in this room take that one simple step of switching their cleaning products from others to basic age to Shackley's cleaning products, which I know you all do, we would save enough plastic bottles from going to the landfill that if you place them end to end, would start right here in Nashville, go across the country, over the Grand Canyon, 
keep going over the Golden Gate Bridge, go across the Pacific, over Hawaii, then keep going all the way Japan, Korea, until you reach the Great Wall of China halfway around the world. And that's just the people in this room taking one small, simple step. <laughs> Suddenly, your act of using cleaner cleaners means that you're transforming the health of your family, you're saving money, and you're protecting the planet at the same time. That's the power of the effect that we can have together. Now, the significance of one small step is true for us, but it's also been true throughout history because every big movement has started with one small act. On June 28 of 1914, a teenager that almost nobody has heard of today named Gavrilo Prancip shot Ferdinand and his wife Sophie. And as a result of that one small act, 70 million people went to war, and it resulted in 37 million casualties, and that's what we refer to today as the World War I. On December 1st, 1955, a woman named Rosa Louise Macaulay Parks refused to give up her seat on a bus. And as a result of that one small act, it helped trigger the civil rights movement in this country. And now there's this wonderful woman, Wangari Mathai. She's a Shackley Honorary Master Coordinator and also the winner of the Nobel Peace Prize. And she started by planting one tree. And then she came to Shackley and she said, you know, there's a million people in Shackley. You should plant one million trees. And then it started with Ellie Rogers and then Bev Willingham and more of us did it. And because there are enough of us in Shackley, we planted one million trees. And then Wangari went to the United Nations and said, if there's this one company called Shackley that can plant one million trees, surely all the nations in the world could plant one billion trees. And they did. And then she said, well, let's plant five billion. And they did. So from one woman planting one tree in Kenya, Africa, Six billion trees have been planted by people all over the world. And there's our very own Dr. Shackley. A hundred years ago, he got burnt by an x-ray. And because he believed that nature had the power to help his body heal, he invented the very first multivitamin right here in the United States of America. And from that one act, today, hundreds of millions of people all over the world take a multivitamin every day, and tomorrow, thanks to you, more of them will be taking Shackley. So don't think you have to do something big to have a big effect. Never underestimate the significance of what you do. You know, so many people come up to me and say, Roger, I'm just a small potato in Shackley. Well, from my perspective, there is no such thing as a small potato in Shackley. Every single person here Every single action you take matters. It matters for you, and it matters for us. Because Shackley and our Shackley effect is simply the sum of all the actions of every one of our Shackley family. And collectively, we are powerful, and together we can change the world. Probably no one said it better. 
than Neil Armstrong as he was about to set foot on the moon. And he said, one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. That's what Shackley is all about. One small step for you. You get the benefits. You get health. You get the potential for wealth. And as others join in, it becomes not only a step for you, it becomes a step for humankind. And every time you use a Shackley product, you make our effect even greater. <laughs> Think about Vitalizer. It is virtually impossible for people today to hunt and gather all the fruits and vegetables and other food sources that you would have to consume to get the nutrients that are in Vitalizer. But our scientists are really, really good. And they worked really, really hard. And they have, there's 12 patents just on the delivery system alone so that they could get all these nutrients and put it into one itty little bitty strip that you can and can afford to take every single day. And you get all those nutrients for the price of a small, or what they call a tall, Starbucks cup of coffee. That's the value that you can get for Shackley. And the nutrients that we put into Vitalizer are not there by accident. Our scientists formulated based on what was the largest long-term supplement usage study ever done. And in that landmark study, it showed that people who took multiple Shackley supplements over an extended period of time had markedly better health than those who simply took a multivitamin and those who took no supplements at all. So when you take this little strip, when you take this little strip, not only are you taking what could well be the best health insurance for your own self, but you are also helping to transform the entire healthcare system of the United States. Because if we project out the benefits from the people in the landmark study across the entire population of the United States, we could save this country up to five hundred billion dollars in health care expenditures. And that would allow our country to invest more in education, in jobs, in research and development so that we could once again make our economy a shining light that can provide opportunity for all those who seek it. But Vitalizer is just one way to make an impact. Obesity is probably the largest preventable cause of chronic disease today. And so tens of millions of people right here are overweight and are looking for a solution that actually works. And so we created the Shackley 180 system to provide an easy and simple way to introduce people to how they can lose the weight and learn how to keep it off. And the entire program is designed to be simple so that people are encouraged to take small steps every single day until a healthy lifestyle becomes a habit. And it starts with one simple step. Taking your Shackley smoothie every morning. It's not that hard, it's delicious, and it's also probably the healthiest meal on the planet. And we didn't just make it scientifically advanced, we made it so that everybody can afford it. So if you introduce three people to the Shackley 180 program, you can get your product for free. Now I just wanna reiterate how one small step can have a really big 
effect. If just the people in this room help one new person a month get their Shackley 180 products for free, by the time we all gather together again next year, our business in North America will have doubled. And that means the income of the people in this room will double as well. Let me share a story about Tara Doolin. She doesn't know I'm going to talk about her. But she's a fitness instructor from right here in Nashville, Tennessee, a local Shackley family member. Now, she joined Shackley in 2009 as a gold ambassador. When she joined, she was using vitalizer and protein, and she felt different, more energy, more vitality. And her friends began to ask her, and she was sharing it with her friends and family. And even though she's a busy mom homeschooling her two sons, her business took off. She became a fast-track coordinator. And she got to go to Atlantis with her sponsors, Nathan and Jenny Oates. And she was doing great. But then in 2012, her business hit a bump. And she reverted to senior director. Now that was a very interesting moment for Tara because she could have done what so many others do, get discouraged. Oh, I did it, but now it's hard, and I was there, and I, I'm no longer, and I feel bad, and I'm just going to quit. But she did not do that. She knew that this and Shackley could provide an opportunity that really would make an effect on herself and her family. And in January of 2013, this year, eight months ago, when we launched the Shackley 180 system, she saw that as a way to reignite her business. And she got inspired to lose five pounds. Five pounds. And with those five pounds came nine inches. And then people started to notice that. And her friend said, what are you doing? And she said, well, I'd be happy to share it with you. And then she got her products for free. And they said, well, I want to get mine for free. And she hosted three for free parties. And they got their products for free. And suddenly she started to jump. And she went and became a senior coordinator. And just since January of this year, doubled her income. But there's more to this story. Tara and her husband, Matt, were able to pay down their mortgage. They're able to save more money for their beautiful sons. They're able to fund several home improvement projects. They even can budget for a bi-monthly cleaning service. And of course, they're going to be cruising with us this fall. All. Yeah, give them a round of applause. All because she took the first step of losing five pounds and used the Shackley 180 system. Okay, right now, I want everybody here to take a small step together. If you have a phone, pull out your phone and go to your Shackley 180 app. Now, if you click there on the upper left-hand corner where those lines are, that's the menu. Click on that. And then on the bottom left, it says three for free. I want you to click on that, please, the three for three. And it's going to pull up three different email icons, which is a prompt for you to send three emails to people asking them what it is. So click on one of them right now. And up pops a pre-populated message. And all you have to do is personalize it. So I'm going to personalize it with somebody. <laughs> and then I'm going to personalize my greeting. Dear Oprah, congratulations on your recent interview. And then I'm going to personalize my sign-off. Look forward to seeing you soon. Warm regards, Roger. Then, on that upper right-hand corner, it's not that big a deal, just push the send. <laughs> now, that wasn't hard, was it? Come on, Shackley family, was that hard? 
That's a small step, but you never know what's going to happen. By sharing Shackley 180 or any of our products with somebody, you could potentially change their life. And if you get the right person, it may actually change the trajectory of your entire business. That's the impact that we have every time we do something. And it doesn't matter where you start, as long as you start and you keep moving forward every single day. Anti-aging is an enormous market. It's an enormous market, and we have this amazing product called Vivix. In fact, thanks to your efforts, Vivix has become the number one anti-aging product in the world for the Shackley family. Congratulations. <laughs> and later, you're going to hear from Dr. Bruce Daggy about what happens to your body after you turn 50 and why it's so important to do the prep work before. But let me set the stage for a moment. Just in North America, there are 180 million people age 49 and above. And those of us who are younger are getting there in a hurry. <laughs> now, Bruce is going to get technical, but I'm going to break this down so it's very simple. This is your body. Your DNA gets assaulted millions of times every day. This is your body on Vivix. Which one do you want? Now, obviously, that's an oversimplification, OK? But if you actually take the time to read what's on the carton, on the outside packaging of Vivix, it's really quite extraordinary. It says, Vivix is an all-natural scientific advance. Sorry, that's the wrong side. OK. Slow aging at the cellular level. The first thing is cell defense. In a clinical study, it's right here, Vivix ingredients blunted the biological stress response, which can lead to cellular aging. That's pretty good. In a laboratory study, Vivix ingredients increased energy production, which declines as we age. In laboratory studies, Vivix ingredients protected and repaired DNA, which is assaulted millions of times each day. And if that wasn't enough, this is a mouthful. It says, Vivix ingredients in laboratory studies activated key genetic regulators that improved cellular performance and slowed the formation of damaging age proteins. Now, maybe that's not the clearest and simplest language. But the bottom line is it says that Vivix is proven to slow the aging of your cells. And I have some really exciting news to share with you today because we just received a patent from the U.S. government on Vivix. And what that means is that no other company in the world will be able to market a product like ours. And the only way those 180 plus million people are going to be able to get the best anti-aging product in the world is through you, our Shackley family, and that's an enormous opportunity for all of us. So, whether it's one teaspoon, one strip, one smoothie, or one swipe, with Shackley, each of these acts allow you to have a big effect on your life, on the lives of people you know, on the economy of our country, and the health of our planet. That, ladies and gentlemen, is what we call the Shackley Effect. Now, I like to talk about the effect that just one man, Al Hagerman, has had. 
because Al was our very first master coordinator in Shackley. And he's celebrating his 50th anniversary with Shackley this year. Al, will you please stand up for a second? And Carol, please stand up, Carol. Now, how did Al build one of the biggest businesses in the entire direct selling industry? Well, he didn't go out and sponsor 150 people in his first month in the Shackley business. In fact, Al keeps meticulous records, so we know exactly what he did in his first month. What he did in his first month in May of 1963 is he sponsored three people. Let me share with you who they are. Audrey Doth, who was the nurse of his then wife, Joan. Lee Scott, who worked at the University of Minnesota coffee shop. And Tom and Sharon Fowler, who are brother and sister-in-law. That's it. That's what he did his first month. Three people. By the way, do you remember three for free? Three people. <laughs> now, he didn't stop. The next month, he sponsored 11 people. And those 11 people, coincidentally, are the size of his church softball team. And that's where it started. And those small acts in May of 1963 probably seemed quite insignificant at the time. But they led to an enormous effect on Al, his family, and nearly 100 thousand other people who've been introduced to Shackley through that lineage over time. Now, Al didn't start out making big money. His wealth compounded over time, which is the way that all true wealth is created. If you take a look at what he earned in his first year in Shackley, it's $5,731.72. Now just imagine if Al at that point in time said, you know what, I'm doing a lot of work and I'm earning just under $500 a month. This Shackley thing, not for me. Not a good use of my time. I'm gonna devote my time to something else because it's too hard for too little. He could have quit. He could have given up. But he didn't. And this is what's happened in his earnings career. The first seven years, he earned $293,000. Now, that's a lot of money. But here's the interesting part. His business did not start to really compound until years 8 through 14. Because in years 8 through 14, he went from earning $293,000 to $1.6 million. <laughs> Things take time to fully ripen. And so over the course of his 50-year career with Shackley, Al has earned in excess of $30 million, which means it's averaged more than $600,000 a year for 50 consecutive years. That's an amazing statistic. But it took time. Now, not everybody here is going to earn the kind of money that Al and Carol have earned in Shackley. But what I love about Shackley and what I love about our business is that every single person here has the same and equal opportunity to do so if they're willing to do the work and stay the course long enough to get the benefits of your efforts. Now, when I first bought Shackley, my father told me, he said, Roger, 
It's going to take you 10 years to transform Shackley from the leading natural nutrition company to a growth engine that can compound for decades to come. And I have learned so much from my father, but 10 years ago, I said, Dad, I think you're being a little too old school here. It's going to take me three to five years max. And he just smiled because he knew. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you the sales chart for Shackley over the last nine and a half years, because this is my 10th year with Shackley, and you'll find out Best decision I ever have done. Love this company, and I am proud to be your partner. Thank you. Thank you very much. So let me share what we have done together. This is a graph of the first seven years. We did a lot of hard work together for the first seven years. More than 50% of the sales of Shackley Day come from products that we introduced during this period of time. We have hired new management. We launched the Dream Plan. We expanded internationally. We did a lot of work, but it didn't really show materially in the results for the first seven years. Yes, we had an increase, but some people might come and say, you know what, it's not a good return. You're working too hard to get that kind of return. But things take time. Look what happened in year eight. We started to grow. Then last year we grew another 33%. Now our first quarter we grew over 50%. And by the end of this year, we will have double the size of our Shackley company in just the last three years. You guys are doing an awesome job. So my father was right. He almost always is. That was one of the annoying things growing up to be a son. But <laughs> thank you, Dad, for sharing your knowledge. But he always told me that real wealth is not created overnight. It's created from your efforts compounding over time. And you'll see here, there's our wonderful Shackley Master Coordinators. And some of them took 10, 20, 30 years to get to where they are. Others took a year. But all of them did the same thing. They kept at it, one action at a time, year after year after year, and never gave up. Now, I want to tell you another story. It has to do when Sloan and the kids and I moved from New York City to California because Shackley is in California, and that's how we changed our life. So we were excited. We're going to California. California sunshine. Afternoons at the beach. Well, then we realized that we didn't move to California. We moved to San Francisco. <laughs> and Mark Twain said it best. The coldest winter he ever spent was the summer in San Francisco. So I like warm weather, and I'm an outdoors person. So I said to Sloan, please, let's try to find a place outside of the city. And we looked, and we got very lucky, and we found this beautiful vineyard just north of San Francisco. And we named it after my daughter, Violet. And a number of you have been there, and you know how special a place it really is. But like all things, or most things that I get involved with, I'm always wanting to invest in it to make it better for the long term. So after a summer started to make an investment and make the vineyard even better. And it took eight months. And when the work was finally done, so and I threw the kids in the back of the car and we're driving up, and this is what I had in my mind the last time I saw this beautiful vineyard. Beautiful green vines, laden with grapes, blue skies, warm weather. And when I pulled up to the driveway, this is what it looked like. And to make matters worse, 
this is what my neighbor's vineyard looked like. <laughs> so I called up the vineyard manager and I said, don't you think you should have told me that all my grapes are dead? And he said, Roger, where did you grow up? I grew up in New York City. And he said, that explains it. And I said, explains what? He goes, that explains it. Let me give you your first lesson in grapes. There are different kinds of grapes. And your neighbor's grapes are Chardonnay grapes. And they bloom early in the spring. And your grapes are Cabernet grapes, and they bloom later. If you have a little faith and a little patience, I know patience is not your strong suit, Roger, but if you have a little patience, I promise you, your vines will come back. And sure enough, I had a lot of faith, and six weeks later, my vineyards return to the beautiful one that they're supposed to be. Now, as I've become a farmer, I've developed enormous respect for those amongst us who grow our food for a living. And I've realized there's a strong analogy between farming and Shackley. First, everybody who farms has to have a leaf of faith that after the winter, spring will come. And when it seems like everything is gone, it will come back because as in Shackley and as in life, there are going to be moments when you think success is never going to happen. But we operate in incredibly fertile soil. Never before in human history has there been a greater demand for natural products that can keep people healthier longer. Never before in human history has there been greater demand or greater need for people to earn an income so that they can provide a better financial future for their family. And what's unique and special and beautiful about Shackley and our business model is that we allow every single person here and anyone else out there in the world who wants to join us the opportunity to participate in the growth that we have the good fortune to have in front of us. That's so rare. You should clap for that. I'll tell you why. 99.9% .9 of all businesses retain all the profits for themselves. But at Shackley, we have created a participation economy. That's why, over the last 55 years, we have shared more than $6 billion to people just like yourselves sitting in this room. And the exciting part is that that is just the beginning. In just the next 10 years, we hope to pay another $6 billion. That is an enormous amount of wealth that we hope to share with people all over the world as our business grows. So the rich, fertile soil is there. You just have to do the daily, small steps so that you can nurture the seeds that you must plant in order to reap the harvest that you so deserve. And sometimes your neighbor's vines will bloom. Their Shackley business might grow faster than yours, but do not be discouraged about that because it is not a race. Do you remember the story of the tortoise and the hare? Who won? <laughs> Actually, at Shackley, everybody can win, okay? But, but in the story with the tortoise and the hare, the story of the tortoise is, is that he just took one small, slow step every single day. He didn't take a nap. He didn't skip a days or weeks or a month. He just kept at it. And then 
if you take your small step and have the patience to stay with it long enough to get your results, that's how you're going to create the biggest effect for you and your family. The history books are filled with people who achieve their success because they refuse to give up in the face of adversity. Johnny Cash, one of Nashville's most prolific songwriters, wrote over a dozen songs before he got his first hit. Give him a round of applause if you like his music. He had to wait another year before he had his second hit. And then they started to come and compound over time. Thomas Edison, a contemporary, an acquaintance of Dr. Shackley, tried thousands of failures before he was able to develop the first commercial light bulb. What would have happened if he quit after he failed the first hundred times? <laughs> Our own Dr. Shackley started this amazing company when it was the age of 62. At the age of 62, when some people start to think of retired, he created what later became a fortune 500 company, it's never too late to start. Now, I know from personal experience that it almost always takes longer than you think to get to where you want. But we are blessed and privileged to be in an industry, the natural health prevention industry, that's going to compound and grow for decades to come. And we are blessed and privileged to be with a company that pioneered this industry and has a leadership position in it. So the opportunity is there for all of us. And the question is, will you take it? If there's one thing I hope you take away from the next three days and one thing I've tried to share with you this morning is that that one small step that's within your power to take can have a huge effect. So the next time you hear your favorite song on the radio, remember, it started with just a few simple notes. And the next time you see a bunch of grapes, remember, different kinds ripen at different times. And the next time you take a vitalizer, remember that you are helping to transform the healthcare system of your country. And the next time you see one of the Shackley Master Coordinators walk across this stage, remember that they became millionaires the same way that you can, one small step at a time. So take that step and keep moving forward. You will have a big effect on yourself, on your family, on your friends, your community, your country, and the world because you are the Shackley effect. So take that step and change your life. Thank you very much.